Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we got another video for you guys. So we just hopped into the wrong mode by accident. We kind of took an L there. But anyways, what we're going to what we're gonna be doing is hopping into a heist video. Now we haven't done one of these in a while. Um I personally really like heist, it's one of my favorite modes in the game. It's really underrated in my opinion. I like heist and siege like on the low. They're very, very, very good modes, almost up there with Brawl Ball for me. But what we're going to be doing is trying out M's. Um, I had her 500 before the last game. Just got her there. I'm not really, um, you know, too happy playing M. She kind of feels like every, like, just like five other brawlers. Kind of the same play style, same mechanics, stuff like that. So I wasn't really too intrigued to play her. She's definitely not a bad brawler. She's pretty fun. Just nothing new or nothing unique. So I was kind of just whatever with it. But just looking at this map, I feel like M's can be really, 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 really good here. So we're going to hop into some games and we're going to see how broken she can be. Let's hop into the, the top. Of, you know, that's it. Let's just hop into some games and hopefully she dominates. Let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the first game. Earlier on today, I, I accidentally streamed. Um, I clicked the stream button by accident. So I streamed for a little bit and the servers were really, really off. So hopefully everything is fine. Kano isn't moving, so it's obviously not the greatest sign in the world. So I feel like EMZ could be really, really good off the start here. Just, you know, maintaining position in the bushes because it does cover a lot of area. You can kind of just peek, take some shots, and just cover a ton of area and do a ton of damage. So that was my thought process. And obviously when EMZ is on the safe, it just does an insanely good amount of damage. Let me show you guys real quick. We got a kill and did 15% like super, super quickly. So obviously this is really good. We're just gonna get the mic down with our slowness super. Ali hopefully can just shoot that. Uh, we're gonna be able to pick up that kill. And I mean, we're just on the safe. We're looking really good. We're doing a ton of damage right now as we always do when we're on the safe. And I mean, it's just looking really, really, really good for us. I think we only need one more shot. There we go, that's gonna end it. I mean, that was fast. And I feel like my hunch was kind of proven there. We got star player, faced a pretty decent team. But that's not it. We can't just play one game and just, you know, that just will answer our theory. Let's hop into the next game and hopefully we can see a repeat of the same thing. Absolute domination. Let's hop into it. Okay, so here we go into our second game. We're going to be going up against Anita, Jesse, and Primo. So definitely a really good comp on this map. Again, we're going to do the same thing. Kind of, kind of just try and stay in the middle. Hold this middle ground down while we can. We already did a ton of damage. Almost have our super. It's looking pretty good so far. We should be able to pick up that kill. There we go. We got the Jesse. We do some damage to the Primo. And now we're over here. And I mean, we just do a ton of damage. So we're just going to go straight for that safe. Going to do a little bit of regening. And then try and get this Primo and Jesse. We're going to be able to get both. And we're going to be right back on the safe. Doing a ton of damage still. Going to try and regen a bit. Use our super. And again, just a ton of damage, not even letting them close. And I mean, wow, that was an amazing game. Absolute domination again. Really, really well. So anyways, let's hop into the third game. But it looks like my theory is actually working out a little bit. Let's hop into it. Hopefully we face a just to absolute top end team, killer team. That's just absolutely amazing. And let's see if we can pull off a dub. So let's hop into it. And hopefully we get what we want. So here we go, hopping into the third game. Another good comp, this one a little bit different, so we're going to be able to test ourselves now against some range, which is obviously definitely a good test. We've gotten mid-range and close range in previous games, but we haven't really gotten long range too much. So this is going to be a fantastic test for our M's. Going to take a few shots over there, and wow, really, really quick double kill. Okay, sorry, we lagged out of the game for a sec. We're back though. Didn't miss a thing. So we're chilling, doing really, really well so far. Okay, we're kind of stuck over here though. Gonna move down. We shouldn't die. Wow, a ton of damage done right over there. We're gonna go down. Ali should be able to get that kill. She's gonna be able to do so. But we got stuff on our safe right now. And obviously that's not ideal, but we're gonna be able to take that out super, super easily and quickly. We get a juke going there. And honestly, we can leave a Jesse on our safe. That's not really the biggest deal in the world. But we are going to go down. They're doing really, really well so far. It looks like we're struggling a little bit against range. Let's see if we can get a shot off. Just walking forward here. Going to use our super. We're going to be able to get that kill. No, we're not. Wow. We got full clip by the Rico. So it's pretty close. I think Ali's going to be able to get that kill. She is. I'm just going to take a shot over here at this turret. We're going to be able to take it down. And again, we don't have any issues leaving a Jesse on our safe, so if that's what it comes down to, that's fine. 
We were just chilling over here hiding. Oh, we weren't able to get that kill. Jesse goes down, but we are losing by 30%. We just need like one kind of attack on the safe with myself and the bull or myself and the Nita, and we should be fine. But it hasn't happened yet. So it looks like Ali and Kano did get us the lead. I believe I'm one or two ticks away from super. There we go, we got it. Gonna move up over here. I'm probably gonna go down, but we just did a ton of damage. Oh, we're gonna get a kill. We're gonna push them back pretty far. It looks like we're doing a ton of damage to the safe. We're just going to stand over here one shot, and that is going to end it. So that game was definitely a little bit tougher. Connell was going to come out of there with the star player. They were definitely a good team with a very different comp than what we've seen so far. So range definitely does counter EMZ on this map, or I mean M's. Let's hop into another game. Again, hopefully we kind of face the same thing, and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the next game. We're going to be going up against Barley, Bull, and Anita. So another good test for us. We're going to move up over here. Again, same strat. We're just going to kind of be in the middle holding this down. I think EMZ might be the best middle brawler um, on this map along with along with 8-Bit. 8-Bit's a just killer on this map, but we are on the safe, so that's obviously looking really good. The three ticks do so much damage, so that's obviously what we're looking for. Gonna try and get super off this bull. We're gonna be able to get it and probably take him out. No, we're not gonna be able to take him out. But we're gonna do a lot of damage on this safe. It's basically gonna be all up to if Kano can defend or not. He's able to kill the bull, which is really, really good for us. There's a Barley on the safe, though. Hopefully he can get one more kill. He killed the Nita. Oh, this is going to be really close. Oh, Ali's shooting the bull. No. Oh. <gasps> wow. 1% and we we're able to get the dub. Wow, what a game. Base races are always so, so, so fun. That was insane. We're going to hop into one more game. Let's see if we can go 5-0 on the video. That was an insane game. Hopefully we get something like that in the last one. Let's get into it. Okay, so here we go into our final game here. We're going to be going up against a team that we haven't really faced. A tick. So that's going to be like control mixed with range. That's going to be super, super interesting. Let's see what we got here. Oh. That's definitely something you don't want. You definitely want to stay away from running into a bull. Oh, and it's just out of our range too. That's tough. That sucks. Hopefully we can pinch this bull with Allie. We got to get this bull out of here. We take those shots. Allie's going to be able to pick up that kill. Kano did some good damage, so we're not totally, totally behind. But we definitely need to start catching up. We're going to take out that turret really easily. And I believe Kano can get that Jesse. So we're definitely in a decent spot over here. I'm going to get some shots off. There's no way that tick head is killing us. So we're looking pretty good. Gonna take some shots over and use this angle so that we can also hit shots on the Jesse and the tick. It's looking pretty close, but we should. Oh my god. We won one to nothing again. Back to back games with the one to nothing win. Wow. That was pretty insane. But, anyways, that is going to be it. I believe Ems is a definitely good brawler on this map. Um, I don't know if it's reliable enough for competitive, but we, you know, who knows until we try it out and maybe we will. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. That is going to be it for now. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's going to, you know, that's just going to be it. I will catch you guys again tomorrow. Um, working on the siege guide is probably going to come out in the next couple days, as well as I got a couple new series is coming out that it is, or not, not series is a couple new series coming out. <laughs> soon. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's going to be it for me today. I will catch you guys later. Peace.